It's called Earth, but its surface is largely water. These waters teem with life and unexplored wonders. They give us food to eat and air to breathe. They may even hold the key to sustainable energy well into the future. Unlocking the mysteries of the deep has challenged humankind for centuries. To truly understand the secrets locked within our oceans, we must have a presence there to watch, listen, and learn. Our national and global future depends on it. In 2006, the University of Victoria in British Columbia, Canada launched Venus. Venus ushers in a new era of oceanographic research. An advanced cabled seafloor observatory, it provides real-time interactive access to the wonders beneath the surface. The Venus facility supports two cable networks. In Saanich Inlet, north of Victoria, a four-kilometer array of cable and instruments gathers valuable data on ocean processes and seafloor ecology. A second 40-kilometer array is located in one of Canada's busiest waterways, the Strait of Georgia. Here, Venus focuses on ocean currents, marine ecology, and sediment and slope dynamics of the Fraser River Delta. A central node collects and delivers information to the University of Victoria Data Centre via powered fibre optic cable. From there, it can be distributed to research laboratories, classrooms and science centres worldwide via the Internet. The systems allow Venus scientists worldwide to adjust instruments to unusual events, such as subsea slides and storms, and to monitor the movement of marine animals. Venus instruments will provide continuous real-time data for decades to come. In 2007, a second ocean floor observatory was unveiled. Conceived by an international team of researchers, Neptune Canada is the world's first regional cabled observatory. With a network spanning 800 kilometers, Neptune Canada is strategically positioned over the northern Juan de Fuca tectonic plate off the coast of British Columbia. Its instruments and sensors will allow us to study and observe Earth and ocean processes like never before. Innovative technologies, such as the Vertical Profiler System, will let scientists observe specific undersea events, provide data to more accurately estimate commercial fish stocks, and help us all better understand and prepare for climate change. Other sensors will monitor tectonic plate activity helping us identify and understand the early warnings of earthquakes, tsunamis, slope failures, and volcanic eruptions. Potential energy sources, such as methane hydrates and volcanic vents, can be studied safely and continuously from thousands of kilometers away. Scientists, policymakers, and educators will gain a new understanding of the complex forces at work in our oceans, and through the internet, Users of all ages will share in discovering one of the last unexplored places on Earth. Developed in partnership with industry and managed by Ocean Networks Canada, Venus and Neptune are promoting the development of new technologies that can be exported worldwide. Their deployment puts Canada at the forefront of ocean science and exploration. As our unblinking eyes in the ocean, Venus and Neptune Canada give us a new way of studying and understanding our planet's ability to sustain life. What they reveal about our vast oceans will help shape new public policy, spur economic development, and provide unprecedented learning and discovery opportunities around the world. This is our opportunity to build a brighter future for generations to come. Ocean Networks Canada is a non-profit society responsible for the development and management of Venus and Neptune Canada. <laughs>